Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Brett here from Webtech with Brett. Now I realize that even though I have a lot of Joomla content on my website, I haven't actually shown you guys some of the basic questions that are being asked here. So one of the questions that I see does get asked quite a lot is how to install plugins on Joomla. Now this is a really easy, fast thing to do. So I'm gonna show you right here. This one here is my own personal website, but this is what we're gonna be using for the tutorial. Now to install a plugin, it is really quite simple. You pretty much go under system and you have a little install thing here called extension, discovery and languages. We're gonna to wanna to click on the extension tab and then you're gonna have these options here, which is install from a folder, install from URL and install from web. Now, most of the times you can install from the install from web however it's not going to be like wordpress where you can just one click install when you click on these you're going to go of course to the website that they're actually on and then go and click the download link in the corner sometimes these will lead to the site sometimes they won't but once you've downloaded the actual software here which you can see all the compatible versions for joomla 4 and 5 you can download the core version of this and in this example we are using a keeper backup which is a great backup tool for Joomla. Now, since we've got that downloaded, what we're gonna to want to do is go to the upload package and we're gonna just drag that into there. That's gonna do its thing and bang, it's installed. Just remember that you can either have components, modules, or plugins. So these are three different types that are available in Joomla. They essentially all do the same things, but they work in different areas. I do have a video based on components and plugins and extensions so do look at it for it on my channel. Now with this one that is just installed you're likely to find it always under your component. If not you can always find them under the system extensions and you can order it by ID in the corner here by clicking twice and usually the thing you've just installed will appear at the top of the highest number ID. So if these do say component, you know that they're gonna appear under the component drop down here in your menu. If they say plugin, you won't find them there, but where you will find them is under systems and plugins. Again, you can just order these by ID, click on these ones, and then you have the options in there to edit them. If you're looking for the modules, if you've installed a module, these are gonna be found under content, site modules now you're not going to see them in this direct list but when you click new you gonna see all of your modules that are installed here so you can click these and then basically just fill in the thing save them and attach them to a position and you should be good to go so i hope that tutorial was helpful and very quick for you now if you do need help with your joomla site remember to check out the qr code that's been on your screen this entire time that qr code leads directly to my website where i'm able to support you and help you in the future should you need anything as always thank you for watching the video it really means a lot when people tune in and see what i've got to say so leave a comment of what you'd like to see next and if there's any quick videos i can pump out for you i will do so peace